Ready to hold this engage right now? I am not doing anything again. There's a total. Hi guys, welcome back. Hello. So uh, today we are outdoors after a very long time. I want to test my GPS hold code. I've been working on this for almost almost a month, over a month now. And I'm not sure whether it's going to work or not, but I wanted to be outside because it's quite difficult working in narrow spaces. So right now I'm on the ground and you can see the drone here. This is a drone. So the main part uh, to me today's test will be uh, to check whether my GPS, uh, the GPS controller or the PID controller, uh, will it be able to uh, position the drone to its home location or whatever location I have set. So I want my PID controller to kick in as soon as I switch on my altitude hold mode. So on switching on, uh, the, the, the PID control of the GPS hold should uh, make corrections to the pitch and roll so that the drone locates, uh, come back to its original location. So that is what all about and most important, I do not have a compass on this drone. So that's why I have to orient the drone. The north and south. So as you can see, this is the drone. The white arms are the front. This is the rear. This is the right, left. So right now, this is the north direction. I'll show you on the compass also. You can see this is the north direction so my drone is aligned to my magnetic north as you can see there is a north and my drone is also facing the north this is important because uh, without the compass the drone uh, won't be uh, able to identify its orientation with respect to the earth's magnetic field so I have set it in the north south direction and that means that your angle in my code is currently zero and the drone will keep its heading and whatever corrections need to be made as per the GPS output or the PID output it will be made in this so I am hoping it will work so uh, let me just show you the controls okay. this is the remote I am using a very basic remote so there are six channels on this remote this uh, is the throttle stick up down the roll and pitch stick and this is the yaw which I don't want to use and for the GPS position hold I will be using this channel this is the fifth channel in my remote so this is the off position this is the on position and my controller will identify whenever there is a signal greater than 1800 pulse from this channel this channel it will switch on the altitude hold so let me switch it off okay i will do a test run i hope i can get a video out of it okay let's go on okay the first test was uh the first test now i i actually did the test i did not have a video of that the gps seemed to have worked i have recorded the data it is a pid pulse correction on my laptop here recording it here uh, so I will try to uh, try to redo the entire thing again I hope I'll capture it this time once I can execute the height hold I will make a video of that uh, so you can see the drone here this is my GPS module okay so and as I have already mentioned in my earlier videos this is the flight controller the second controller which communicates with the GPS module by this wire this serial port and you can see the LED is blinking this is a one hertz blink which indicates that we have a GPS fix we have the GPS fix 
okay so let's go get on with the flight i have to align my drone with the uh, north south direction in the north south direction so as you can see this is the north south okay so you can try take this off Hi guys, good morning. So today is 19th of December 2022. Uh, I'm back for the third outdoor test. We tried our GPS hold positioning. GPS positioning uh, hold yesterday. Uh, we had success. I got a video at late evening. Not very clear, so I wanted to try it out today again. I hope uh, it's win, so we can test our GPS hold. Mm. Okay, so I'll go ahead. So I, I like I've already mentioned, I do not have a compass, so I have to align my drone in the north south direction. And also I do not have the height hole, height hole right now. I have disengaged at the height hole using my sonar uh, so right now I have to control and throttle myself manually and the positioning roll and pitch will be taken care by the GPS positioning controller ok so I'll go ahead I'll try to take a video so as you can see the compass is on my watch so the drone is uh, calibrating the gyro right now Okay, uh, gyro calibrated, and as you can see, my GPS position is fixed with the corners blink. Okay, now I will arm the drone. Go back. I'm switching on the remote. Remote on. Drone max. Mean again, drone is armed. And you are right, drone is ready to fly. The altitude, uh, sorry, GPS hold is off right now. As you can see, the GPS hold is on right now. Drone is making the correction. This holding is positioned, although in a large. Very large radius. It's swinging a lot actually. There's a very strong wind. is holding his position I'm not doing anything I'm reducing throttle right now to bring it down GPS hold is still active Not engaging any roll or pitch stick, reducing throttle right now. It's making aggressive correction. Okay, so the first attempt uh, it worked out actually. Uh, as you can see, the drone was hovering in a certain position with a big, with a big error margin, uh, at least five to six meters. This probably 
uh, because of the PID, I guess I have kept the PID parameters very low not to have very aggressive corrections as well as not the lack of compass in my drone. So these are the two things which may have caused the large oscillations. Anyway, I will try it once again. Uh, if this works, it means my GPS positioning is working. Uh, I just need to tune it further. Okay, this is the second attempt. Attempt number two. And I would also like to tell you that there is a very strong wind. There is a very strong wind blowing towards the south actually. It, it is against the heading of the drone. So, so that means you can make out how the GPS is effective in mitigating the wind effect. All you hold is engaged right now. I am not doing anything again. There's a total. Increasing total. It is drifting away slightly. Decreasing total now. Drifting away towards the south, but it seems to be working. Increasing total now again. Okay, friends. So this covers my entire work on the GPS positioning. So thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Do like and subscribe to my channel, and please do press the bell icon for more of these interesting videos. Thanks. Have a nice day. Bye bye.